Good evening to you, Mike Cherry. Quite a mess here at a very busy intersection in Tilton. We're on Laconia Road. This is the off ramp for I-93. Many people will recognize the Tilton Diner here behind me. That has been evacuated as a result of this accident. Want to bring in Deputy Chief Jubert with Tilton Fire to talk to us about what exactly happened. This happened just before new, uh, 11 o'clock this morning, right? Correct. We got notified by our dispatch company that there was a motor vehicle accident with a rollover. Uh, we responded during our response. We updated that it was a propane tank, uh, propane truck that rolled over in front of the Tilton Diner. Very busy intersection, so we want to make sure we had appropriate response. We weren't sure of the size. We thought maybe it was a home delivery propane truck, but this is a supply truck. So uh, upon scene, we saw that it was rolled over. The driver was out of the vehicle. Tilton PD did a great job. Uh, they closed down traffic prior to our arrival. We arrived on scene. We were able to meet face to face with the driver. The driver stated that he didn't believe there's any product that was being released. We investigated, we metered, we confirmed. Um, we're leaving the area closed off at this time because it could be a potential leak. It currently is leaking some diesel fuel. Um, the truck is at full capacity at 30,000 gallons, plus the fuels uh, tanks are filled as well with diesel. So there are some issues that we're trying to deal with, um, but we're managing it right now. I understand it could be three to four hours before you offload that gas, is that right? Uh, correct, so there's a lot of product in that tank right now. And by the time vehicles get here to move the product from one tank to the next tank and a potential burn off, you're talking probably three or four hours before that can happen. Deputy Chief Juber, thank you very much. Want to bring in Chief Cormier with Tilton Police to talk about the traffic uh, headache that's being created by this road closure. Sure, Amy. Obviously, it is a busy intersection. It's the intersection of Laconia Road and 93. And so right now, all my units are tied up trying to basically divert traffic away from the scene. But what our hope is in the next hour to create a traffic plan to get traffic through here safely, but around the scene itself. So we've assisted the, uh, requested the assistance of the Hampshire DOT. They brought out sign packages and cones. We're hoping within an hour to have some uh, traffic flowing through here. Chief Cormier, thank you very much. So you heard it, within an hour they hope to have some modicum of traffic flowing through this intersection, but really the word of advice to drivers this noon is to avoid the area if you can. That's the latest here from Tilton, Amy Cavino, WMUR News 9.